the answer for this question is fixing point five. Let's see how easy. There are fourteen hundred students, and out of fourteen hundred, thirty-five percent are girls. So fourteen hundred. Fourteen hundred is nothing but hundred percent. Huh? Out of hundred percent, thirty-five percent are girls. The remaining when uh, thirty-five taken out from hundred, remaining is sixty-five, which means the percentage of boys is sixty-five. Now well, let's find how many girls. Girls, uh, the number of girls can be obtained by thirty-five percent of fourteen hundred. And number of boys is sixty-five percent of fourteen hundred. So this is how we can obtain number of girls and number of boys. Then, what next? We have uh, provided with the information the percentage of boys and girls who pass the in an exam. So eighty percent of boys and ninety percent of girls pass in an exam. But What we were asked, we were asked to find out the percentage of failed candidates. So, if eighty percent of if eighty percentage of boys uh, passed in the exam, then the remaining twenty percent failed in the exam, isn't it? So, the number of boys who failed in the exam would be given as twenty percent of total number of boys. Similarly, number of girls who failed in an exam. Is ten percent because ninety percent passed in the exam, so ten percent got failed. So ten percent of total will give us the number of girls who failed in the exam. So ten percent of thirty-five percent of fourteen hundred. Now ten percent of thirty-five percent of fourteen hundred will give us four ninety, and ten percent of four ninety is forty-nine. And here, how many boys? Sixty-five percent of fourteen hundred. Sixty-five percent of fourteen hundred users nine ten. So twenty percent of nine ten, and twenty percent of nine ten is ten percent is nine ten. Twenty percent is one eighty two. So this uh, some users told the number of students who failed in the exam. How much is it? Uh, one eighty two plus forty nine is uh, we are two thirty one. So out of fourteen hundred students, two thirty one students failed in the exam. But they are not asking us how many students failed in the exam. They are asking us the percentage of students who failed in the exam. How do you find the percentage? Two thirty one by total fourteen hundred into Hundred. These two zeros will get cancelled. Fourteen one fourteen. Remaining is ninety one, and fourteen six eighty four. Ninety one minus eighty four are seventy. So I know minus eighty four is seven. If you put this one, it becomes seventy. Fourteen five is seventy. So this is how we need to solve this particular problem. If you find this video helpful, do like, subscribe, and share. Thank you.